last time on. I remember what happened in the ending to last chapter. <laughs> I don't even know what kind of dance that is, but she's sure hitting the something. Whoa! Wait a second. Susie, I, uh, I have something for you. <laughs> okay, see you, bye. Ah! Look at that face! That's so cute! Oh, how wonderful. They have not been up to anything strange. Haha, <laughs> no, they've been... They're no- <laughs> I will now talk about a hole. It was dark, filled with darker dull hour. Dull, dull, what? Dull of, dull of, dull, dull of war. Fuck me. Now back to the show. Just wanted to show off your huge house, huh? No, I want to show you is upstairs. But what's this? Oh, I nearly forgot. This is where I cook. You cook everything in a giant witch's pot? Of course. Cauldron cooking is very convenient. Here, Chris, Susie, have a cake. What the fuck? Hmm, a little thick on the frosting. That was for sharing. Hey, everyone was free to make an interception. Clearly, you don't own a cauldron. Alright. BF, living quarters for bad guys. Let's take a look then. Everyone's still in a cage. And it's King Round. It's very violently protecting the jail. We're still behind bars for some reason, but it's okay. We've grown to love this hellish place where we dress as animals. We decide to dress as kings as cultural <laughs> ex cultural exchange. Oh jeez. So is Rosie's dad? Oh shit. Lancer's dad is here. Ah, the lightners. Have you come to humiliate me? No. Mr. King, the lightners have returned everyone here safely. If you're willing to reconsider then. What? Live in a kingdom ruled by you? The Lightner's little patsy. Staying in the cell is far less humiliating. Now, if you will excuse me. My giant hamster wheel is getting cold. The fuck? Okay. <laughs> By the way, is my son happy? Like you care? You were gonna throw him off a cliff! Ah, the prejudice made my bluff too effective, I see. Besides, even if I threw him, he would just... Bounce. My son is... A bouncy little pumpkin. Aw, oh, cute. We're done talking to you. Ah, He does care. I think. I hope. Hey. Anyway. What's in here? The door is locked. Okay. I was kind of hoping Jevil would be back there so I could just fight him if I wanted to. But whatever. Second floor, living quarters. Right. Wow. Well, I have a surprise for you two. I made rooms for you in the castle. Rooms? So you can stay here whenever you want. Uh, I'd be happy if this place could be like a second home to you. A place that you can go no matter what's happening outside. <laughs> well, we'll take a look. Alright. Let's check my room first. Hmm. I know it's meant to be relaxing, but it's giving me some serious Amori vibes, and that's kind of nerve-wracking. It's some decorated moss. It looks delicious. Why the hell does your room get moss? <laughs> it's your bed. It feels incredibly soft, like sleeping on a dream. I wonder if that's, uh... What's the word? Foreshadowing. It's a stand for your manual. I thought you might want to keep it here in case you want to read it. Do I still have my manual? Oh, I don't. I guess that is the manual that I was given. It's a shelf. All sorts of keepsakes could be kept put here. 
It's a wardrobe full of all sorts of different clothes. You could wear whatever you want. Can I, though? Doesn't look like I can. It's a stand for your manual. Alright. Hold on a second. That bed looks almost exactly like Azrael's. That's... strange. Anyway. I have a feeling like Toby is just leaving little nuggets of plot foreshadowing here and there, you know? But maybe I'm just reading into it too much. Alright, let's check out Susie's room. Oh wow, this is a cool room. And Susie, this is your room. I tried to make it something you'd like, but you can put anything else you want in here too. I really hope you like it. My own room, huh? I guess that's pretty cool. My own room, like this. How long did it uh, take you to do this? Well, uh, since I last saw you two, I... <clears throat> Duh! Man, you're a real weenie, you know that? <laughs> I think she likes it, Chris. Ah, jealous, I got the cool room. Look, Chris. Ah, oh, this puts a big smile on my face. Susie's so happy. It's a clothes drawer full of spiky and dangerous clothes. All the clothes are ripping each other into shreds. Hell yeah, jealous Chris. Susie, you didn't get to read the manual. So I pull over here for you. Cool, I'll read it before bed. That'll put me to sleep. <laughs> yeah. Wait, is this a fridge? Damn, there's everything in here. Pine cones, chalk, moss, jaws of salsa, pieces of ice, black crumbs from the toaster, jawbreakers. Oh, like actual food too. This bed. Cool, spike bed. Now I can stab myself during the night. Finally, some convenience. <sighs> okay. Honestly, this is very heartwarming. And Lancer, let's check out your room. What the fuck? <laughs> Why? Why is it making that noise? Answer, you aren't gonna believe how sick my room is. A room as sick as you? Whoa, I wanna see. I'll keep digging holes until I reach your room. Uh, it's got a door, you know. A door? Wow, boy, you want you went all out. What the fuck? <laughs> it's some kind of digging implement. There's salsa buried in the ground here. It's a hole, presumably dug for fun. It's a hole made recreationally. You found 20 rupees in the hole. Unfortunately, that's not a useful currency here. And what's this? I love that my floor is full of holes. Okay. And the bed? Wow, it's better than I remember. I even have my own bed now. Now I don't have to sleep in a hole anymore. But I thought you already had a bed. No, that was for the bike. What the f- Okay. What the f- <laughs> Alright, what's here? Hey, Rossi, what's up here? Oh, just more rooms I'm renovating. So is your room up there? Uh, yes, I still um, haven't dusted it, though. Yeah, like we need to see your nerdy glasses collection anyway. Nothing wrong with glasses collections. Alright, I guess that's that. So, what do we do now? Feel free to explore the town until you're ready to leave. Ha! Like we're gonna leave now, right Chris? I mean, we kinda did all we set out to do already. We checked everywhere, unless there's something else. Oh yeah, let's save. A 
castle child has transformed into a friendship. Yeah. Oh, I didn't save until now, did I? Wait, level two? How did I get level two? I never killed anyone. That's suspect. All right. I guess that's that. Well, let's keep looking around. Hey! Whoa, horsies! You've been brought us to great new place. We'll be putting our own elbow grease into fixing it too. Well, maybe not elbow grease, that's gross. Nostril grease? That's even more gross, my guy. Without trees, I must gain nutrients by eating clothes. Such is the way of the worm. Looks like the clothes are nibbled. Take a bite? Yes. You put your mouth against the mannequin's cheek. Chris! Don't bother. It tastes awful. And Susie? <laughs> oh. I like being like this. Don't tell anybody. You do you, Bell. It seems to be locked. It may never open again. Hmm. That's a little ominous. Alright, so that's to the right. What's to the left? Oh, it's just the rock slide thing. Oh, it's quite a wonderful town, really. Thank you. So, why am I alone here? A bit of self-reflection, I suppose. I do realize I was quite a coward before. So I wanted to say, well... I still am! My cards, I cannot handle society! For now, I'll be living at the top of this cliff. When I'm ready to meet society again, I will be back. Thank you. Thank you for the wonderful home. I will not use it. <laughs> okay. Well, that's that, I guess. Alright. Time to go. Wait, Chris, we're leaving? But we just got here. Man, I don't want to go do our group project. Oh, you two have homework? Uh, well... Susie, Chris, you ought to do it right away. School is important. I banish you from this kingdom until you start your project. Ugh, fine, I'll do it, cheese. Susie, don't worry. I'll go ahead and help you too. Uh, wait, Lancer, perhaps you shouldn't. Too late, kind boy. Friendship form. Lancer was added to your key items. What? Where'd he go? Don't worry, I just entered your inventory. I'll just be hanging out in Chris's pocket. Don't know what that means, but okay. Fear not, I too shall assist death. Uh, we're good. Aha, quite. We, as a team, are good. It always became a key item even though no one wanted that. Alright, your mouth already, let's get going. Good luck today, Chris. See you soon. Okay, let me... I want to check. Let's see. What the... What the f... They're just chilling there. <laughs> Alright, let's check the cell phone. You tried to call on the cell... I forgot I did that. Let's check Lancer. Ho ho, I'm tough boy. Treat me like one of your items. I love it. Rose card. Thou gazest upon man most handsometh. This daring genius adoreth beyond all ki all hey. Well, that's that I guess. Let's get going. Up we go. Well, damn, guess we got to our project. Sigh. At least we got Lancer, right? Lancer, who are you? Damn, guess he skipped out after all, huh? Hmm. So, where should we do this? What, the library? Ugh, well, alright. Off she goes. Cards. 
cards. The Jack of Spades and the Rules card. Rules? That's what he was. The Rules card. I was curious. I was like, who? There, there was a pun in that name, but I couldn't figure it out. Oh my god, I can drop him. I am not dropping him. I'm not even going to check what happens if I attempt to drop them. You held the cards. They felt flimsy between your fingers. Nope. Not even going to try it. I am curious, but not that curious. What the heck? <laughs> Sounds like a traffic jam. But there are only two cars in the... In the what the fuck? <laughs> what? Damn, I was just directing traffic as normal. <laughs> when a little dog drove one of these toy cars into the middle of the street and started doing donuts. In the chaos, all the cars in town got jammed up. Thankfully, no one was hurt, but ordinarily, ordinary citizens like you gotta get out of here. I got some heavy lifting to do. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Traffic's moving at a snail's pace. I love snails. Could today get any better? This dude looks like he's going to die. I heard a dog was doing donuts, so I sped over here. But I just learned donuts is actually the name of a special attack for cars. Why is my life stuck in a... Did you hear that? I heard that. I don't remember what song that is, but I heard that. Oh! Metaton! Actually... Are the cars making a song? They are making a song! They're making a bunch of songs! That's cool! That's really cool. Alright. I don't think I'm gonna be getting anywhere. So off to the library we go. Alright, we're here. School, goddamn project. Books, goddamn crazy about them. Hey, Chris, where the hell is everybody? Something seems kind of off. Screw it, let's just go play Space Pinball in the computer lab. Uh. Huh? It's like. The inside of the closet? Chris, you don't think this could be... Another dark world? Well, guess this means we can't start a project. Unless... You know, Chris, if there's a dark fountain in there, you can seal it, and it'll turn back into the computer lab, right? So what's it gonna be, Chris? Let's go. We can use the computer. My house. <laughs> no, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, let's just drop the act. Our last adventure was great, right? I couldn't stop thinking about having another. I don't know what's in there, but we can't live if we don't find out, right? Come on, Chris. Yeah, that's really hard on your knees. This is new. This is very new. Alright, let's go. Dark world? Alright, down we go. Ooh, nice sliding animation, Suze. What's this? The wires. The wires. Okay. Oh, that's very new. Everyone was... Huh, seems like the electrical wires are doing something. Everyone else has been... Save us, she's going to. Why can no one in this place finish their sentences? Somebody help me. Somebody, please. Susie? Cool that you're here, just... Wait, get out of here before it's too late. 
Noel! <laughs> Whom the fuck? Hell of a study session. Who the hell are you? I am known as serial number Q5U4EX7YY2E9N. But you foolish children may call me. Queen. <laughs> I we're gonna call you Queen. Q5U37 uh Queen. Queen. Well look, Queen, we're not children. Teens are merely big children, and adults are even bigger children. <laughs> stupid, big stupid. Doesn't that make you a child too then? No, I am a computer. Smart. Computer? Well, thank you for the stimuli, but I must leave now. Goodbye. Wait, wait, why'd you capture Noel? I would have captured you too, but I ran out of cages. Why the capturing? <laughs> So that she may become my willing peon. In my quest for world domination. Also, maybe I'll make her face into a robot one. What? Why? Seems cool. Well, forget it, dude. No one's turning anyone's face into a robot. Could that be a statement of anonymous animus dissension? Dis fuck my life. Could that be a statement of an animus dissension? Huh? You wanna fight, loser? Yes! Yes already! Yes! Okay, then bye. Wait! A goddamn sec! <laughs> I have no time for such frivolities, and we'll kick your ass. Or perhaps someone else who then turn to you. Oh no! Oh shit. Enjoy your assimilation. Alright. Wear wire. Let's do some checking and defend. Wear wire. Controlled by Queen's wire. It's sleepwalking through a nightmare. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Okay. Okay. I get it. Toss Chris to free wire. Okay. Uh. Hmm. Uh, I got one. Wire greatly loosened. Wow, I suck. I missed. Great. I honestly feel like this, like the jumping difficulty could end me dying. Which would, would probably not go so well. I got one. Right. You jiggled your body. The wire loosened in turn. Hey, look at Chris hitting that thing. Nice. They got the moves. Susie Spirit, where wire? Uh oh. Okay. Let's try and jiggle and can't do much with that, so let's us hmm. Yeah, this is for the best. You jiggled your body, the wire loosened in turn. Susie used the club sandwich. Didn't suck. We could have got gotten through this round and to use any items. Ah, <sighs> oh, well. You won. Zero XP and twenty two hundred and two delta bucks. Phew. Nice fighting again after so long. Now let's go catch up to Queen. Or not? Huh? They calm down. I just use my pacify spell to put them into sleep mode. Rousey, you're here! I felt a dark presence and hurried over. 
It seems that a new dark fountain has appeared. Rousey, they got Noelle. Damn, what was she thinking messing in our dark world? If we don't do something, she might be... Why not, Susie? All you have to do is seal the fountain. Yeah. Yeah! Can't be mad about another adventure, right? Come on, Chris. Hell yeah! Let's go! Back on another adventure again! Ooh! I like that music! Oh fuck! Jesus! <laughs> Fucking took a turn- Oh my god! <laughs> wow! I- I- Just when I think I couldn't be impressed anymore, Toby fucking outdoes himself. A green field extends before you, and in the distance a city shines brightly. You are filled with the power of a two new adventure. Hell yeah! Let's get this bread! If you enjoyed the video, feel free to like, subscribe, and maybe watch some more. Be seeing ya.